let fear bite you and realize it has no teeth. It is Thursday the 1st. Are you scared? Sounds dramatic. You know what? A lot of people are held back by that fear. The fear of the perceived pain that will come if you do the thing you want to do that you fear will hurt you. These chemicals are designed to keep us alive. They're designed to stop the thing that is going to threaten our very existence from happening. This used to be the saber-toothed tiger. This used to be the big angry buffalo that had genuine teeth and would rip you to bits if your fear did not keep you safe. Your fear and genuine acknowledgement of this thing that may kill you, you need to survive. However, very rarely these days are we faced with something that is genuinely going to kill us. Very few things out there have real teeth that are going to rip you to pieces. Very, very few things. But the chemicals don't change. We have still got the same hardware. We are still operating with the same plan, the same blueprint. And you are letting that fear stop you from doing things that you want to do that will not cause you any long-term, genuine, physical pain. Let fear enter your existence and then go right up to it and let it bite you. And you will realize it does not have teeth. Over the other side of fear is progress. Over the other side of fear is leveling up, is changing, is evolving, is growing. Doing the thing that you fear is more often than not the one thing you need to do to change from where you are to where you want to be. And it does not have any teeth. As it gets closer and closer, your mind tells you get away. Get away, run away, stop. Do not do what you're about to do. It's going to hurt us. Hold your hand out. Let it bite you. And it comes right up close and it intimidates you and you're right on the moment of when you were going to ask that person out. When you were going to raise your hand in the meeting. When you were going to step up and say, I'd like to take part in this coaching, in this fitness class, in this whatever. I would like to be heard. I would like that job. I'm not happy with this relationship. The thing that you fear, let it come right up to you. Feel that fear grow inside of you and then let it bite you. Do not run away. Let it bite you and have that moment of realization where you go, it hasn't even got any teeth. The fear was not real. I created it. And then smile at it. It's the first of the month. Let's go for it. I'll see you tomorrow.